Hey guys, what's popping? What's good? I'm going glamping literally tomorrow. So I want you guys to help me pack. I'm gonna run out to the high street and find a few bits and bobs and then I'll be back to show you pretty much all of the mess I've made so far and make it a little bit of a small mess. I think that's a good plan. Let's go. Now, if you don't know what glamping is, it is basically a glamorous side of camping. You know, if you're camping, you need to get your tent, you need to get everything together, but they provide a few things for you. Now, there's a really luxurious side of glamping, then there's the middle. I think we're in the middle because we are provided with a sh some shelter, provided with a plug and a sofa bed. So that's it and then outside we have um table chairs and a deck to put a barbecue on so we have like the staples of living but nothing to live with so we bring everything like a stove um you know pots and pans bedding and everything like that so more glamorous side of glamping would be like they give you duvet breakfast in the morning and everything but we're still doing all of that ourselves, which we're actually really excited for so i will be taking you guys along with me glamping i'm going to be doing some cooking so i'm going to be filming that <laughs> hopefully it goes well I'm a bit nervous we'll get into that later and then i'm also just going to film the overall experience where i stayed and if i think it was worth it but before i even go i've got a lot to do i'm leaving tomorrow and i was going to order some clothes but i always order clothes and i'm wondering why my wardrobe so full so this time i decided to grab everything out of my wardrobe that's what you can see in the background and just make a few outfits so that's what we're going to do now i'm going to put some bits and bobs together i'll try them on and then that portion's done after that i'm going to run to the high street and just see if i can pick up some bits and bobs and then pack will be ready to go. So this was the complete mess that I was describing. We've got some PJs over here. And then I'm just thinking this is camping or glamping, you could say. It's got the browns, it's got the greens, it's got some tropic vibes. So <laughs> there are some staple pieces that are already like set, like dresses, jumpsuits. I'll quickly show you those now. So for example, I have this really cute jumpsuit that I've never worn and I just always wanted to wear it at like a safari or like you know um if i went to you know them drive through zoo places i don't know if you know what i'm talking about but that then we have this little backless number and the reason i'm bringing these are in case oh i'm going with my boyfriend by the way so if we end up doing a photo shoot you know there's a little little something little cute and it's backless two more dresses this looks super crushed but literally it stretches to your skin so i can't really iron it anyway but um yeah this is looks really really simple but this is another little green number so look they're the ones i've shown you and these are like the extras but i'll figure that out now i'm gonna try everything on show you when i get to camping but this is a little a little dress for you know if we're doing a little a little photo shoot if we go to the beach and then these are just like windbreakers, little things to keep me warm. So I think I have done very good here for the things that are in my house. So guys, I'm back from the shop now. I couldn't get everything I needed because I didn't have my ID. So I couldn't get coal for a fire. I couldn't get all of that stuff. I can't really see either right now. So just bear with me. But um, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to show you the mess that I've created from everything that I've packed now. And then we will put everything in a suitcase and we'll be done and ready to go. So this is what we're working with so far. I know it looks like a bit of a mess, but it's all gonna be organized. So we've got some skincare here. We have like wipes, some bowls because I got an actual set on Amazon. So I didn't need anything but bowls because it came with everything else. Got some tea, some washing up stuff, some um, bug spray. You know toiletries so i pretty much have everything that i need here moving on right here we have some painting equipment because painting in the wild sounds fun and then we have electronics and equipment so i've got two cameras and then we're going to add the laptops and everything here um i've got my nike bag to put everything in and some snacks Lastly, over here, we have all of my shoes and clothes that I've tried on and made an outfit. Suitcase here, so everything's gonna have to fit in here. And then the duffer bag for all the accessories. Let's go. Uh -huh. 
Last, last. Now everybody go to our breakfast. guys you left us off <laughs> <laughs> hey guys so we left off when i was packing back in london and now we're in devon took about five and a half hours don't want to get into that too much but we're here now this is a glamping pod out in circ clips of what it looks like to the side but this is all going to be about the outfits you know what we packed so we've gone for a little bit of a rustic look today these are some overalls that I got while thrifting and then we've got Tim's can't really go wrong I had them for years and yeah we're gonna go on a long hike up Tavistock took me a long time to say that word but we're here now so yeah it should be about an hour and a half of walk it feels sunny but I still feel like taking my coat I'm in a bit of a dilemma what should I do tell you in a bit I said it I said I would change so this one's a little bit I had a dress on basically, did a little photo shoot, which I'll insert next, and then yeah, got a boyfriend's trousers on. But it's a look, we're gonna call it street style. I might get a few, you know, pictures in it. Yeah, I'm feeling, I'm feeling fine. Ooh. It's a little bit cold, my allergies are airing up. But, um, <laughs> and I've also changed. Don't so matter. You be in your bag. We're going to try and do a little photo shoot here now and I'll show you a bit of behind the scenes. and executed so let's just start off with the pants these are from Bershka and they cinch in at the waist which is really nice you can also use this detailing to you know cinch a bit more but it's kind of for decoration purposes love that and then we've got the Tims can't forget the Tims very very comfortable and good for long walks walks which is what we're doing here and then I'll quickly show you this which is actually a full catsuit like bodysuit it's full mesh so don't know what my bow out that's why we've got the trousers on and it matches but we've got some keyholes here and there's a little keyhole here um and a few details but I covered that up with this from Primark which is just like a fleece overlayer let's just call it a layer on top of your clothes because I really don't know the terms right now but yes um it's only four pounds and it's very comfortable I wear it every day and it does actually keep you warm surprisingly and that's it guys the journey has come to an end I thought I would show you my little outfit for the car we might find another spot on the way back don't mind the crocs <laughs> but the real outfit will obviously have my tims on which I've been wearing every single day and then we have this little windbreaker turtleneck which I've been loving and then you can see these windbreaking trousers as well i don't know what you call those but they match the top to this makes me look like i work at sainsbury's so i thought i would switch it up but yes i hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you in the next one bye <laughs> 